Hello everyone, I am Heather with another R-rated review for you. Today is going to be a pretty short and quick review um, because I don't really have anything nice to say at all. Uh, it's this product I got from John Frieda. I'm going to grab it. It's supposed to be like a glaze, luminous glaze for brunettes. So I've been following the directions. I thought I would try it, you know. I don't do much with my hair color. And so it's a gloss. And it says it boosts rich brunette color, intensifies shine. So I've been using it just the way they told me to use it. Um, while I'm in the shower, smooth the glaze through wet hair using only enough product. Um, uh, the, 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 only enough product to cover the hair evenly from root to tip. Wash hands thoroughly with soap to remove product and leave on for at least three minutes. Style is desired. Uh, a glaze each time you wash your hair or a minimum of three times per week. So I wash my hair more than that a week, but I, I, I've done like four or five times a week. I haven't done it every single day. And here's why. Uh, it's garbage, first of all. Um, I thought John Frieda was one of these like a uh, little bit of hoity-toity companies. Like, I thought it was like good shit. It is not, okay. I've had to wash the bottle 10 times. First of all, I'm gonna show you. It pours out like liquid. So let me see if I can. It's not even like a gel. It just pours out. And when you put it in your hands, it runs all over the place. Do you see my head? See my head? I didn't get beat up. This is the product. That when I put it in my hair in the shower last night, must have touched my face. Now this is supposed to not be hair dye, it's just some sort of enhanced color shine. My hair still looks like shit. It doesn't look good. And so let me show you what it did to my fucking bathtub, my brand new bathtub. So all it has to do is touch the bathtub and it dyes it. See that? It has actually discolored. A, a, a blob dropped there and I wiped it right off. This one ran down and I wiped it off. Seriously? And then when it goes down the drain, by the way, it's still on my hands the next day. So I washed my face. I have the makeup on. And I did it because I needed to show you that I've slept, washed my hair, rinsed it all out, and then I do a cold water rinse afterwards, like close the hair cuticles and shit. And it was still coming out of my hair. I think I saw it on my towel last night. Let me see if I can, um... no, apparently I can't. Shit, I'm gonna start knocking stuff over. There we go, okay. I thought I saw, yeah, just some fake, these are brand new towels too, because my bathroom's done, I got a new bathroom, so everything's, so there's still some, see those streaks? That's after I've rinsed it and the water runs clear, and then, I do a cold water rinse, so it gets rinsed again. And then for whatever reason, when my hair drips, it runs into the drain and it discolors my tub. There is no, there's no escaping it. It was on my hands to the point where I was scrubbing with my foot loofah to get it off my hands. And it's stuck on my head now. I can't wash it off and it doesn't do anything for my hair. And it wasn't cheap. It's like, this stuff is like $15. I just, I just highly recommend avoid this at all cost. It's crap, it's garbage, and it will destroy your bathtub, it will destroy your towels, it will dye everything except your hair. So this sucks, sucks. I don't even know if I would return it or if I'll just pour it down the drain. Cheap frugal bitch is not even gonna finish this. If I didn't like it and it smelled like shit, I would probably finish it just not to waste it. But this is way too damaging to my tub, my towels, and everything else in my bathroom to even continue using it. As long as you don't expect it to dye your hair or color your hair or glaze your hair or make your hair shiny. Does it look shiny? It's not shiny, it looks like shit. So uh, skip this at all costs. Uh, John Frieda Luminous Glaze for Brunettes. It's not luminous. It's not a glaze. Have a good day. This is Heather with R-Rated Reviews. And if you'd like to leave a comment, feel free. 
And if you'd like to subscribe, please do so. Have a great time.